what's going on guys my name is marcus welcome back to another video today we're at the goodwill bins sorry about the close-up today we're at the goodwill bins trying to get a bunch of inventory to flip for a profit on ebay pretty far back in line as it stands but we're gonna go in here try and get as many items as we can stay tuned guys all right guys a couple items that will get you zero luke bryan will come after you do not list anything about luke bryan now here's another one it's called grunt style let me show you guys the logo this is what the logo looks like it's just some old school rifles grunt style uh you will see these items listed on ebay and you will see sold comps for them but they do come after you because it's a newer brand and they want all their money and they don't want nobody reselling their stuff lower than them just because you can get away with it doesn't mean your account is worth putting it at risk to sell this stuff guys so i found several of these items here already today one of them had abraham lincoln holding a uzi pretty cool shirt but i'm not going to list uh listing and risk selling or risk damaging my account so just a little piece of uh, information for you guys i know that american girl uh dolls are worth picking up to sell i don't know about american girl clothing so we're gonna grab this and look it up got this corn shirt it's from uh that concert uh april 24th to 2021 so it's definitely not vintage but uh i think they're still on tour maybe they're not but either way it goes should still sell for about 15 bucks got this harley shirt it's from 2008 so it's not vintage but uh somebody passed on it i'm sure because of this stain right there i'm gonna just soak it in oxyclean and see if i can get rid of it if it doesn't come out then i'll just sell it for like ten dollars which i'm sure it'll sell at that price but definitely gonna get this guys got a mountain t-shirt with a leopard on the mountains uh, size extra large so i'm sure this is like a kid's extra large because that don't look like i don't know maybe it's a women's extra large i'd have to check the measurements to determine if it's a men's or a women's but uh these shirts go for like 15 bucks nothing crazy guys got the vintage grandma cat sweater made in the usa uh on the old school hangs tag i've never even seen this type of hangs tag i don't know if this is valuable but i still think that some old lady somewhere that loves the 80s or 90s would probably at least look for this to some capacity so maybe i'll look it up see what we got going on victoria's secret pink with the bling this type of stuff does good for me 15 20 bucks let me look it over make sure there's nothing wrong with it uh there's some type of discoloration on the sleeve never mind well 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 guys look what i got underneath the cat sweater faded glory my arch nemesis if there ever was an arch nemesis all right guys so i tried to look this up and it just keeps bringing me like actual clothing for dolls and this is a medium for a kid 10 to 12 uh so definitely not gonna waste my time I'm gonna throw it on back all right guys we got american eagle camouflage cargo shorts ridiculous sell through is over 100 percent it's like 400 listed over 500 sold uh the most recently was july 25th which is i think today yep that's today sold for 35 dollars 21 dollars 24.99 uh then we got some bids 17 29 25 22 25 uh so definitely gonna get them guys we'll list them about 30 bucks because these are a little bit distressed and uh i know that some somebody's gonna send me a low ball offer i'll probably accept an offer probably as low as uh 18 dollars on them just because i'm getting them at the bench you know what i mean so yeah guys definitely gonna grab those i got uh more american eagle shirts with american eagle uh thermals i've been selling these for about 15 20 bucks just depends on the size the bigger obviously the more i can get for them but this one right here should sell for about 15 20 bucks and it is my size so i will probably wear it until it sells uh i love doing that man those polo pants that i said i was gonna wear those uh pajama pants ended up wearing those for uh, like three or four times and then i sold them yesterday so let's go baby all right guys got some abercrombie sweatpants over 100 percent sold through right on these as well uh, i didn't type in the color but we got 29 15 15 29 99 vintage 80s champion and abercrombie reverse weave what sounds like a super collab uh american
American. Um, this is Abercrombie 2732 uh, 50. Man, I wish these were vintage. Maybe they are vintage. I don't know. I'd have to do a little bit more research on them. But if they're vintage, they can go for about 50 bucks. But just looking like this is just going to go for about $20, guys. Got some uh, Abercrombie cargo shorts here. Size 16. So I'm thinking that means they're boys. So I typed in Abercrombie cargo shorts size 16 and uh it's bringing up boys $17 $16 $26 $26 $38 $12 $14 another $24 so uh we'll grab them guys listen for like 25 bucks and see what type of sale we can get out of those got this vintage lens and made in the USA uh 90s $28, so we'll get it guys, listed for about uh, $25. We got these L.O. Bean pants, they're like quick dry um, hiking pants, 100% sell through, right? Uh, $13, $25, $18, $24, $13, $20, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, so yeah guys i'll grab them i'll list them at like 22 dollars and try to get me a decent sell out of them so i want to discuss this tragedy that we have on our hands here uh jordan bulls jersey right uh size small but the tragedy about it is guys is someone cut it right and then they sewed it back together I guess to make it shorter why would you do that what is wrong with people man so this isn't going to be worth anything uh let me look it up and see what it would be if it was in good condition okay so just a general generic search we got 90 we got uh 100 we got 50 we got 65 we got 76 we got 129 dollars these are white but 42 35 40 454 dollars uh 37 bucks 100 that's uh team uh, anyway 64 89 you guys get the gist of it man so thanks for screwing me over whoever cut this we got this uh fud pucker shirt i just grabbed it because it looked cool uh we got some sold comps for nine dollars twelve dollars five dollars fifteen 22 for a tie-dye one which is his tie-dye hey there's the exact one somebody sold for six bucks oh man uh well i guess i'll be putting this one back got this rolling stones 1972 usa tour shirt i don't think this is vintage i'm gonna have to hit my boy daniel up and uh send him pictures of this tag and see if it is it is a little bit distressed with like holes in the, in the armpits but i'm still gonna get it and uh, if it does turn out to not be vintage, uh, it's my size, so I can at least wear it, you know what I mean? Uh, so I won't be out of a loss or nothing like that. But uh, Daniel, be on the lookout, bro, for some pictures coming to your inbox soon. Got this vintage Family Guy shirt. I don't, I'm not finding this exact one, but the sales are okay on it. Stewie shirts at least, um, $20. Uh, let's see here. 18 18 that's a simpsons we got a 55 with stewie as an emo kid that's not this one though uh 13 21 so uh i'll get it guys listed for about 15 dollars because the graphics cracking on it but yeah still gonna snatch it up guys got this vintage shenandoah national park shirt sells for 12 dollars 14 dollars nine dollars let's see these are Yosemite. I don't know how that's coming up. But yeah, guys, $12, $15. I'm pretty sure somebody's going to flame me for not knowing who this Dilly Dilly shirt is. But we got some comps all over the place. $2, $21, $7, $17, $7.50, $8, $10, $12, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15, $15
back looks like. Cat just chilling. Uh, surprisingly incredible sell through. 100% uh, sold for $11, 19, 15, 24, 24, 19, 15, 15, 18, 12. So yeah, definitely gonna get this guys. We're trying to list it for about uh, 20 bucks and see what type of sale I can get out of it guys. All right, guys, I've never heard of this brand carrots, but man, banger. Not banger, but really great sales price. $39, $59, $28, $26, uh, $22, $29. Twenty-nine, dollars 29 These are the exact ones right here, $40. Bucks. Definitely going to get these guys. All right, guys, the last item I feel like I'm going to be able to show you guys are these uh, Columbia PFG shirts I showed you guys in the one of them i think the last bins video these go for like 20 to 25 dollars a piece so i'm definitely going to get both of those well we got the vintage ll bean uh fleece jacket 30 dollars uh we got 18 24 25 30 26 uh 39 so yeah guys i'll grab it list for 30 bucks okay guys cool shirt is legit the last item that I can show you guys because uh, as you can see it's 1259 they close at one but we got some sold comps for 15 20 18 10 20 uh, 25 29 30 about 30 30 dollars 19 uh, yeah guys so I'll get it for 20 bucks and that means it's time to go all right guys i got to go through most of it with you but i'll catch you guys back at the car for a financial breakdown and tell you guys what i spent and uh how many items i got all right guys here we are back at the car with a total of 94 items right we spent 96 dollars and 99 cents i got the phone in the shade this time for a total of a dollar oh three per item which is pretty good i was hoping to get 100 items on this trip uh but very close that means i'll need to get um the rest of my items on the next trip but this shirt right here the rip and dip shirt should go for about 20. i got this nascar shirt that i didn't show you guys on uh on the inside it's brand new with tags uh they're selling for about 20 dollars and then these carrots pants are going for 40. so these three items would pay for everything but then i also got this polo blazer that i didn't get to show you guys on the inside as well i'm um, seeing comps for 40 to 80 bucks on it but this one's a little bit uh faded and uh i don't know if that's paint or yeah that'll come off but i should be able to get about 40 dollars for this and that means the rest of these items are profiting you guys know that that's how i like to do it here at the goodwill bins buying stuff to flip for a profit on ebay that's gonna do it for this video though guys catch you guys on the next one until then, let's make this cash, guys. Peace.